Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to the video. Now, I have been grinding a lot and I can finally buy all the new cars in the Vehicle Legends Halloween event. Now, we're gonna go ahead, get those, and test some of them. So, without further ado, let's get right into it. Alright, now off camera, I bought all the new event accessories. I bought one of each rim and I also bought all of the license plates right there. Now, though, let's go ahead and start buying these cars. Right here, we got the Ransom Skylight, top speed of 168 miles per hour, 0 to 60, 4.7 seconds, handling 40%, 300 pumpkin cost. We're gonna go ahead and purchase it right here. There we go. Next up, the Crosser Stallion Exec, top speed 186 miles per hour, 0 to 60, 4.2 seconds, handling 50%, 600 candies. Let's go ahead and purchase this one right here. And last but most, certainly not least, the Cavalla 377 Grand, top speed 220 miles per hour, 0 to 60, 3 seconds, handling 62%, and it's got a pumpkin cost of 1,650 pumpkins. We're gonna go ahead and purchase it right here. There we go, we bought all the new cars. I think I'm gonna go ahead and customize each of them. I'll show you all um, the specs I put on them, and then we'll test out the Ferrari. All right, now first up, I've gone ahead and maxed out and customized this classic. And the first thing I notice is the tires are glitching through the body. That's something I don't like about it. But besides that, I have no more complaints. I really think it looks cool. Now on to the Mustang. All right, I've gone ahead and maxed out the Mustang. Now this thing, I just love the design of. I feel like it's so cool looking. It's got a pretty cool interior. And it's also got, hang on, let me open it, a really nice V8 engine in it. Overall, this is a pretty sick classic. I have no complaints about it. It looks great in my opinion. All right, I've gone ahead and maxed out the Ferrari and I've done my spec. This thing looks sick, but first, I'm gonna test the drag time on this car. Now, I know it's a classic, so it probably won't be the best, but hey, we may as well go ahead and test it since we have the car. After that, I plan on doing the highway race and maybe one other race with it. I don't know, maybe we'll do the around the map or the, um, What's that other one in the circuit? We might do one of those two, but now we're on the drag race. Let's see what the drag time is gonna be for the Ferrari. Okay, so it launches pretty quickly for a fast, or for a classic car. Um, yeah, let's see what the time is. 7.7 .7 seconds, not bad considering how old this thing is. Highway race, let's go ahead and test the top speed on this race. I'm gonna predict, hmm, maybe like 250-ish miles per hour for it. Let's see if my prediction is correct. Usually that's what these classic cars can do for top speed when they're maxed out. Alrighty. Um, okay, 100, let's see if we can reach 200. I know the Aston, I don't think that was able to reach 200, so hopefully the Ferrari can do a bit better than that one. Um, okay, 240 without boost. Once we get up this hill, I'm gonna go ahead and boost down the hill. That's how you get it to go fastest. Um, all right, 261 with boost. Okay, so top speed of 261, pretty close to my prediction. I feel like this wouldn't be the best circuit racing car. Um, let's do the around the map. Cue a time lapse of that right now. All right, and we finished the around the map race in 67 seconds, which is surprisingly good considering how old this car is. I think we're gonna wrap up the video here though, cause we've gone ahead, tested all the cars. Well, actually we only tested the Ferrari, but we checked out all the cars. Um, but yeah, I think we're gonna wrap it up here. Drop a like if you enjoyed, I would truly appreciate it. Make sure you subscribe, ring that notification bell so you never miss another upload, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.